My next entry is also of 18 January and it says paid Mr. Ali by check of Standard Chartered Bank means on the same day when we purchased the service. Service was for 45,000 but right now we are paying 30,000 by Standard Chartered Bank as a check. So how to deal with it? Obviously we have to settle this pending amount from the bill uh, against this payment. So I'll go to MYOB, I'll close this because this is a report section. Uh, go to purchases. You can notice in the flowchart that after enter purchases comes pay bills. So I'll just click on this. And since we are paying by Standard Chartered Bank, it is selected by default. Otherwise you can just browse it and change it to the relevant account and select Mr. Ali. Now, as soon as you select Mr. Ali, it will show up all the uh, ledger details or you can say invoices uh, with their uh, current status. We only have one invoice right now and the status is open. That means uh, we haven't settled it yet. And invoice was for uh, 18 January 2020. Amount was 45,000. Now, let's say that we are paying by this check number. You can mention any check number for now. And date is 18th of January 2020. And applied amount is since it is partial settlement, I'll mention 30,000 here. Just press tab. Now you will notice that it will show out of balance. That's only because you need to click this amount field once and press tab again. Now notice out of balance change to zero. That's it. This is the most simplest treatment of uh, paying bills and settlement of purchase invoices against the bill, against the payment. So just record it. Now, if I want to see the journal entry effect of it, I'll just cancel it. And there is a transaction journal option in purchase section as well. So you don't need to go on accounts and check the transaction journal every time. In fact, it is more convenient to check it directly from transaction journal of that relevant section. So I'll just click on uh, this transaction journal. So you will notice that it is already on the purchase tab. That means it will show only the entry that is connected to the purchases. So change the relevant period. But since this is a payment, it might be there in the disbursement section. So disbursements is standard chartered bank is credit by 30,000 and trade creditors is debit for 30,000 and this is for Ali. So that's how you can check the transaction journal. So this is the overall treatment of how you can settle the purchase invoices against the payments.